Hi everyone, this is Liz from Creative Life of Liz and I'm here planning for the week of March 22nd through the 28th in my recollections planner. I'm using this relatively old kit from Shine Sticker Studio um, by Craftsmith, it's at Michael's. Um, I think this one's called Planner Girl, maybe? Um, but it's a super cute kit um, with lots of hollow on it. Um, this is my birthday week, so I wanted something a little bit extra. <laughs> Uh, for this particular week. We have tons of habit trackers. Um, how many hydration things do we have? Like, should I just use those for every day? We have two here, three, four, five. Just have five, so I might skip those for now. Um, I'm gonna just pull this all out of this book, I think. Um, guess not. All right, I planned to pull it all out of the book, but that didn't work out. Okay. Um, I also pulled a couple of other books from Shine Sticker Studio with Craftsmith at Michael's, um, just in case I need some extra things. I pulled this week Kawaii Designs from Craftsmith for Michael's um, because it's also hollow foil, just in case I need that. And then I pulled this old Wonton in a Million at Michael's kit. Um, just in case, this was a birthday kit. I used it for my husband's birthday last year. Um, but just in case uh, I wanna use any of like the birthday things. This one's gold foiled, so I obviously don't wanna use any of the foiled things, but I might use some of the other birthday stuff. I also pulled out just this one washi tape um, because I don't have enough headers. So my plan, um, if I can get these out so that this is like made easier. Man, all the rest of these have come apart so easily and this one is like super strong and not willing to come apart at all. Um, so what my plan is, is that I am going to use this wide washi here at the bottom. I'm gonna use this, this uh, kind of like uh, scalloped washi up here at the top. And then I'm gonna put the to-dos underneath where the full boxes go. And then I'm gonna stick this washi tape up here to be the headers and then I'm going to run the full boxes through the middle just like I've been doing basically every week recently. Um, trying to not like break anything but also get everything out. Um, so in this kit there are I think eight full boxes that I can use as like decorative full boxes. Ow, just like hit myself in the face. Okay. We will get there. Um, there, all the pages are taken apart now. So I think there's eight full boxes. We have this one here. This is two. This is three and four, five, six, and then seven. And then I think I'm gonna use this one as eight because I think that one really reads as a full box too. Like these other ones kind of feel like they need things in them um, to really be full, full boxes. So that's my plan. I'm gonna stick down some washi and I think I'm gonna stick down some headers too. Um, stick down these headers. I'm probably gonna go in rainbow order. I'm gonna stick down this washi tape and then we'll be back to do all the fun bits.
All right, so that is kind of what it looks like right now. Um, my preview is not really working, so I just have to hope that you can see all of this right now. All right, so pulling all of these um, to get to my full boxes. This page doesn't have full boxes. I have a little extra strip from here. I'm just gonna save that for whatever I feel like using it for. Um, every, literally every other page has stuff. I'm gonna use this Shine Bright as my full box. I'm a little concerned, this is like a little narrow. Um, so you kind of get it like matching on this side instead of matching on this side. Um, so that's going to be a little different than what I usually do. I don't think, I don't think I have any checklists with like seven in them. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That one's eight. Um, so I'm not going to be like putting my dinners or anything like that on the side. So let me see. If I match it right here, there's still a little gap. All right. We're going to match up on the left side for a change. That's super weird. I've never done that. Um, but I think it's going to look just fine in the end. Okay, so oh, I forgot to use these guys. Well, I might just add those later. We'll see. Um, let's see. Other full boxes. The other one with like a lot of words is this Planner Girl one. So I'm going to stick that one on Thursday. I mean, just a sliver of a gap between them. Um, kind of like for consistency's sake, I guess. So, let's see. I feel like this one, this one, and this one are kind of similar. Do I have another one that kind of fits with that vibe? Not really. Um, the other two both have foil. So I'm gonna stick one foil on each side, I think is my plan. So I don't, I don't know how I wanted to buy these, but I'm just gonna start sticking things down, I think. Tiny sliver. There we go. Then I think I'm going to stick this one down right here. Like so. And then I'm going to stick um, maybe this one. And then this one right here. And then I'm gonna stick this one. Oh, I do have a weekly box. Great. I'm gonna stick this one right here. And then my last full box I'm sticking down is this one. looking super cute okay so working on the sidebar I have um I think I'm gonna use the remember I have these like don't forget which are cute but they're like rounded which bothers me for whatever reason I don't know these guys have foil in them but these ones are striped so which one do I want to use um, maybe I'll use a foiled one. I kind of want to use purple, but that's going to be like so much purple over here. I might do it anyway and just divide things a little different than I usually do for the sidebar. 
I don't think that's crazy. Okay, um, so I have a couple of these guys. So I think I'm gonna use them as a header. Like so. And then stick down this this one. It's really weird to really line up things on the left side instead of on the right side. <laughs> Definitely not my usual go-to. And then I'm gonna use the blue, remember, I think. we go. Um, I'm going to stick in this purple habit tracker. Like so. And then I have this little space down here. Um, which I feel like I can fit something, some of this deco. Where are my These big diamonds aren't going to fit, but these diamonds will. I'm going to let them kind of be like at a jaunty angle. Yes, more. Kind of space them out a little bit. I feel like I need like super tiny deco there, but I don't have any like super tiny deco because that would be weird. Um, I don't know what super tiny deco I could possibly have. Ooh, okay, I do have super tiny deco. This is from this Shine Sticker Studio book. I'm just gonna take Maybe this uber tiny star. I mean, this is like so tiny. Stick that in there. And then... And one of these guys. I appreciate that she has a very consistent color palette across all the stuff in this collection. So I can kind of use it interchangeably. Alright, there we go. Have some deco. All right, for the weekly plans now. First up, I need to put in work. And I need to figure out like a good way to mark it. I have six of these, so I could use that. I have these three skinny guys. I have these three. And that couple more skinny ones up there. Um, I have these flags, one, two, three, four, five, six of those. So there's enough there. You could use diamonds. Hmm. I think I'm gonna save these for like, mm, no, maybe I'll use these guys. I feel like that's a good choice. It takes up a lot of time, which honestly my work life takes up a lot of time. <laughs> Let's start with the blue one. Sit that down on Monday. This one can go on Tuesday. And then this one on Wednesday. And then I will use two of those on Thursday and Friday when I flip things over. Also, on Monday, I do want to mark my plan with me. Um, which will need to go up. I think, I feel very indecisive. Does anyone ever have that issue? I think I'm gonna mark it with this little guy right here. There we go. Put up my plan with me. 
there. Oh, I have a weekend banner I haven't used. All right. That's all for Monday. Tuesday, I've got nothing. And Wednesday, I've got nothing. Pretty boring week overall. All right. Thursday. And Friday. We're going to get their little work, guys. There we go. I don't another just busy work week honestly um nothing nothing too exciting i wish this was a half box version so friday is my birthday which i do want to mark i feel like it needs to be in a half box because it's important even though i don't do anything um, looking in here, I could use like one of these. It's not really quite the right color. Does the yellow match better? Mm, not so much. Okay, apparently these colors go terribly. So that's fun to learn. Um, I don't think this one has any like birthday type things in it. Does not. And then I will check this one. I didn't like plan any of these ahead of time, which I probably should have in retrospect. Um, I have some like little covers. Which I could use after I put on, like after I write, I could just put a little cover over one of them. Or this one. Sure, that is like appropriately extra and I barely have used any of these. I even have these like clear boxes that I could have put with this. All right, that's what I'm gonna do. So for right now, I'm just gonna stick this box in like so. And then we will finish that afterwards. Saturday and Sunday, I have nothing planned right now. So while we're at this, let's stick in the weekend banner, um, which I tore a little bit, but it's fine. No one will notice, I think. Um, I'm gonna actually cover the bottom washi with it. So I'm just gonna line it up right at the top of the bottom washi. There we go. That looks cute. And then for these days, what I'm gonna do, oh, I had issues with smearing before. Excuse my reach across this. I'm gonna use these Mean Show pens. I'm gonna use the 0.3 size for all my writing. What I'm gonna do is just put in 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, and 28, like so. And then I think these can just cover this right up. Yeah, that looks perfect. So I'm just gonna put all of these down I'm not even going to fast forward you through this. Hopefully it won't take very long. Um, this week, it's definitely not a lot happening with the whole the world still shut down situation. We're now to people like me, where it's your second birthday in quarantining. But that's fine. We're going to do what we got to do. I'm probably going to pick up some food to enjoy. I might bake a cake. I might buy a cake. I might not eat cake at all. <laughs> we'll see how that goes. But mostly just a quiet week. Um, you will see more details, obviously, um, than what I know right now. When I show you the finished spread at the end of the video. Because I just don't really know what's going on. All right. There we go. I obviously have tons of things left. 
Um, I'm gonna probably use some of these like boxes and things. If I do laundry, I'll use that. When I do my pre-planning for the following week, I will probably use that. I kinda wanna use some more of these really shiny things moving forward. I'm definitely gonna have some like leftover bits like this and stuff. Um, it'll just go into my leftovers. I'm probably gonna try to use this as a divider because I just have so little of it left. Yeah, so plenty of things. Most of it will go in my leftovers, to be honest. I'm just gonna get rid of the cover because I know what this is. Okay, so I'm going to fill in. Hang on, let me show you what it looks like so far. Super boring because I don't know anything, but I'm going to fill in the little bits that I do know um, and then I will be right back. So this is everything. I'm not gonna stick down this one cover. I've never actually used like a full box or half box cover before. So this is gonna be interesting. I think I just line it up right there perfectly. There we go. We can barely see the rainbow parts anymore, but that's fine. Um, looks pretty cute. Um, hopefully not too bubbly. Yeah, that looks pretty good. All right, there we go. That's the pre-planning all done. Stick around for just a second and you can see the finished spread. All right, here is the finished spread. I love how it turned out. It is so cute and definitely very sparkly. So give it a little wiggle and a twerk. Super cute. As usual, I have a ton left over um, from the kit. Uh, I usually do when I use these Craftsmith at Michael's kits. So um, just doing a quick flip through. Lots of things I can use later. Um, I definitely will use them later. Um, don't know when, but throwing them in my leftovers now. Um, the only thing that didn't come from a Shine Sticker Studio by Craftsmith at Michael's was uh, this washi, which comes from Amazon. Everything else came from either the kit or one of the extra sticker books. So yeah, I love how it turned out. Uh, let me know if you have used any of the kits, if you've used any of the new stuff <clears throat> that came out at Michael's um, and also your kits for the summer. Um, follow me on Instagram at Creative Life of Liz to see in progress and finished spreads. I tag all the shops, all that good stuff. Sorry, my cat is like attacking everything. Um, and until next time, bye.